episode of Cabin Crew Simulator. Well, today, I'm gonna find out if I can make one AI helper do all the work on a plane so I can sit back, relax, eat some snacks, and start chilling like a strawberry villain. Guys, if you enjoyed this, please make sure you smash that like button down below. If you are new around here, then make sure you do subscribe so you're notified when that next episode does come out. But today is going to be very, very interesting. So what we're going to do then is we're going to spawn in a plane. Let me clip my uh, my little free bow box right now. Damn, these graphics look terrible. Hold on. I'm on eight. That's what happens. You play too much Croydon right now. you got to change those graphics. We are going to create a flight. And we're going to choose the plane that allows us to have one multiplayer, which is this one. 26 guests, so it's not too many. This is how you grind and get better AI really quickly. So we're going to create you, go over there, doesn't really matter, I don't really care. Uh, we are now going to get to the point where we want to invite anybody, don't invite anybody, we're going to invite an AI. Now, right now, we have your boys Zachary, Layla and Daniel. Layla and Daniel and Zachary are all level 3, but Layla and Daniel are almost on the way to level 4 right now. So we'll choose one of these. I'll go for your boy Daniel, he has his tongue sticking out right now. And just because of that, I want to make this dude work even harder than he ever has done before. So we're going to hire this damn folio right now. Get him on the plane, press done, I'll do no events so we can land the plane as quick as possible. And we, guys, we are going to try and make him do as much work as possible right now. So, falls there, gate six, we're over in this direction. Now, obviously you have to train him up. The more you train him, the better he becomes and the more work he does start getting done. Is this my flight right now? It is. Falls there! The door is opening up very, very soon. He's going to get on the plane. He's like, what do you say there? Let's make this a good flight. Get out of here, you damn fool, you. That damn fool wanted to make it, make sure that he is doing a good job. You better do a good job or I will be firing you. So after this flight, then we should automatically get him to level four. Now, when they're like one star, they do 50% of the work. When they are, what's going on right now? Why are these not getting on the plane? Uh, excuse me. Are you going to get on the plane right now? Why are you not getting on my plane? But anyway, they do 50% of the work when they're brand new. As you start leveling them up and up and up, they slowly start to do more and more of the work right now. I have no idea what's going on right now. They don't want to get... Right, we have to respawn the plane, but now they're actually getting on the plane. Now, I feel like... I think the first set of customers are like, no, 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 no. We're not getting on this damn fool's plane. He's going to crash into the water. But it's okay. They're now getting on board. So this is plane is not too big. It's not too crazy. It should be good enough uh, for us to be able to kind of complete all the tasks pretty quick. So we're going to wait for this damn folios to get on board right now. I don't think there's too many left to go. Is this the last one here? I think that is the last one. Yes. Yes, it is. So once they're on board right now, we can close the door. And then he will then start doing some work. So close the door. Is he going to start doing some work? Right. Sit upright. There we go. Tray table. Oh, oh, he's actually doing some work, guys. He's actually doing some work. I'm going to start from the rear of the plane right now. There we go. Start closing all these cabin overhead things. Bam, 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 bam. So I'm going to, I'm going to help him. He's not good enough just yet to do all the work for me. But I won't help this dude. Oh, there we go. And straight away, we're taking off. Okay. Maybe he did do quite a bit of work right there. But the real kind of challenge will be serving all of our guests, all of our passengers, food and drink right now. So are we good to go? Serving carts on the scene. So he will only go so far to get stuff done. So what we'll do right now, we'll kind of serve from the rear of the plane. We'll interact and I've got foods on the go. So what would you like to eat? Egg sandwich. Enjoy the egg sandwich right now. Anything to eat. A nut mix. Boom. Uh, anything to eat. We'll sort this dude out right now. A bread roll. Bam. Anything to eat. This folio right now also wants a bread roll. Boom. See, I can do stuff so much quicker than that dude. I really can. But we're going to train him up to the point where he does everything for us. Or at least the majority of the tasks anyway. So he's doing what he's doing right now. I'm going to now start serving some drinks up here. 
So anything to drink, sir? Some water. Now, the more you level them up, the more or the quicker they do become. So that's why my dude is pretty weak at the moment. We've got to make sure that he is the best there ever was. So we've got to make sure that he uh, we do a lot of the tasks. We've got to basically make him land planes as many as possible. That's what we got to do right now, boys. That's what we got to do. So, uh, water. There we go. And to drink hot chocolate last one will do right there and will he now serve these remaining guests i'm hoping that he does the great thing about him he can do food and drink simultaneously where we have to keep switching carts so um yeah it should be pretty good so a few more people left right now with ginger ale he serves them and the next person over here is he gonna serve them oh there we go water so again, like I said, once we level him up, he does start to work a lot quicker. So he won't be as sluggish. And then one last customer. Come on. There we go. Ginger Ale. He all over it right now. He ain't waiting around for nobody. I appreciate it. So already, we're now ready to land. So he's going to sort out the trash. Now again, I'm going to help out slightly on the first couple of flights. Um, because obviously he's not a great level just yet. So if I help out where I can, we can get this plane landed a little bit quicker. And then it means we've leveled him up. So damn quick. Right, boom. Boom. Right, sweet. Done. So now we got to prepare the cabin for arrival. Rich, your tray table. Tray table. Seatbelt and tray table. Done. Done. And now we're landing. Just like that. I've never done a plane so damn quick. This is good. This is real good stuff. So the plane shall get landed. We'll get that sweet XP. And we'll see how much that AI has then leveled up. So we're good to go. Yep. So, obviously, I'm sitting at the back of the plane because he stole the front seat. I get all the way down here. Where's the door? The door is just there. Go away for the uh, big jetway thing to open. Right, it's going down. Right, open the door. Open, says me. Today, please. There we go. There we go. So, we've got to open up all these overhead lockers. Now, is he going around long doing it as well? Or does he wait till all the passengers are gone? I'm not 100% sure. But there we go. Done. Easy. Collect. I'm skedaddling out of here. So, of course, I can wait for all the passengers to disappear right now. I can't even remember what city I selected to kind of fly to. But we're going to create our next flight. Get these guys done. And you. You're eventually going to do the whole plane for Create another flight. Here's my dude right now. He'd be chilling. I ain't quite sure he knows where he's meant to be going right now. Are you okay there, sir? Do you know where you're meant to be going? Is he following me? Is that what he's meant to be doing? I don't know what he's doing right now. Oh, no. Now, now he's floating. Oh, dear God. This is terrifying. Right. So, we are now departing number nine, gate nine, which is down in this direction. Is he following me? I don't quite know where he is. He terrifies me, that dude. He low-key terrifies me. But this time, this flight... What we'll do is we'll see how much work he is willing to do on the plane. We'll see what he's willing to do and hopefully he can do the majority of all the work. Now, has he teleported all the way over here? Is he actually on the plane just yet? Or am I still waiting for him to walk all the way over? Let me find out. Let me find out if he's teleported because he is kind of like a little bit of a shapeshifter, isn't he? Is he here? He's already on the plane! You damn fool, Leo. I didn't see you run that quick, you damn fool. So we're just waiting for the passengers to be ready to start boarding, which they now are. So we'll make sure that they do get on the plane. There we go. Then I get on the plane. Now, there's not too many passengers. It's pretty much like the same flight previously that we just did. So we're going to see how much work he's willing to do on this flight. Hopefully, there's going to be all of it. If not, you're getting fired, you damn fool. But he will do all of it, guys. I promise you. He will do as much as I, I will make him do. So that is the last of the passengers, right? That is pretty... Oh, hello. 
I like your makeup. Your face looks beautiful. Very nice. Um, so, here we go. Oh, I can hear the uh, the voiceover going in the plane right now. So we know 100% rocking. Are you going to get up and do some work? Right, shut the door. Okay, he's already up. He's already up. So he's sorting everything out right now. I want to see how far he actually goes. So he, he's now just standing there. Oh no, he's going back to the overhead lockers. Okay. Is he going to go any further than what he's doing right now? He's still going. He's still going. Okay, he's completely skipped this dude right now. Is that as much as he's doing? He's like, okay, I'm done, Zaniac. Bye-bye. Right, that's fine. There's only a couple of peeps he didn't kind of get to. So I'll sort the rest out. Which is fine. You know, we are trying to level this damn folio up. Boom. And take off. So just like that, then we're taking off then. He pretty much did a nice big chunk. He did like half the plane at this point. But we do need to progress him to go a lot further. So I wonder how much he will serve with the food and the drinks. So this will be interesting. Again, it's not a jam-packed flight, so he hasn't got really a lot to do. The majority of all the passengers are actually sitting at the front of the plane where he has to do all the work. So if I'm correct, he got to the lady with the blonde hair. And then after that, it was all down to me. So I wonder if it will be kind of the same right now. So... If that is the case where he stops there, that will be one, two, three, four, five. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there's eight more rows after that if that's as far as he goes. But we'll see if he actually does. He might surprise us and go a little bit further. He might surprise us and go one less. Damn fool. But it's okay. It is okay right now. <sighs> so foolish. So foolish right now. So, there is a few more tasks after I have to get done. But it's now up to the road before the lady with the blonde hair. So, hopefully he does this. And he doesn't go and sit back down because he will be damn foolish if he does. So, he's 100% serving that person there. So, will he go and serve this person next to him? Is he going to do it? Yes, he is. And it's a question whether he serves the lady with the blonde hair. So he's done the food. He's then got to do the drink. And then we'll see. We'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. I don't know why. Uh, thanks. Appreciate it. Now, is he going? Or is he walking? No, he went! One, two, three. He only served four rows. What an absolute peasant right now. What an absolute peasant. Right, so I'm not going to do the rest. Egg sandwich. There you go. You, anything to eat? What do you like? Uh, a bread roll. There you go. You, what would you like to eat? Uh, a bread roll. There you go. Then I'm going to switch it up to the drinks. I'm pretty much doing the rest. Good job this flight isn't that busy. Good job. Oh, what did he want to drink, sorry? Was it water? Ginger ale. So then I ain't got to do too much tasks right now. So if anyone's got like completely full leveled out maximum AI, how much percentage of work are they doing? Are you able to get to the point where you're doing absolutely nothing? Let me know in the comment section down below. So we got one more, one more person. What would you like to drink, madame? A ginger ale. There we go. Right, sweet. Trash next. Sweet, mate. Let's go. Let's go. Trash. Collect. 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 Keep collecting. I know he doesn't go to the blonde lady, so if I just go to here, then all that work after what's left is all him. He has a couple more passengers to go. Damn, he's so slow. He is super slow right now, isn't he? He is annoyingly slow. Annoyingly slow. But that's why you got to level them up, guys. That's why you've got to level them up right now. Right, have you finished this yet, dude? Have you... Oh, oh, there we go. So, repairing the cabin for arrival. Again, I know he only goes to the blonde lady. So, i got to do the rest. Uh, you're okay. Trade table. Uh, and you. And then he will do the rest leading up to this point. Again, I am making him... Do all his jobs right now. I don't care what he says. I'm making it work. 
I'm making him work right now, boys. All right, come on, you damn fool, yeah. Two more people left, and then we can land this puppy. I mean, if it was me, I would have had the plane landed ages ago. But no, we got to wait for this damn foolio to get all these jobs done. Are you for real? You left this one dude chilling? Oh my, just when I thought he went all the way to the end. No, he has to go and surprise us again. Foolish. So foolish right now. But it's okay. Because we got it done anyway. We're just too good. So we're at the back of the plane still and waiting for the plane to actually land. There we go. So we've got to wait for the little jetway thing to technically connect. So we're just playing the waiting game right now. Come on. Will it suck on? Is it good to go? Open the door. Open says me. Let's go. Open. And then people can slowly start getting off. Now, does he actually open up the cabins, the lockers? Or is that just like something I have to do it towards the end? We'll see right now, because this person gets up. And we have to start opening all the ones that I've got to do. No, no, he's actually doing something. He's actually doing some work. Finally. Oh, we got to this point. Oh, is there one more that I missed? Did he close that one? I don't know what he'd done. He is. So freaking foolish right now. He is so damn foolish. I don't care what anybody says right now. Right. I technically got, got him to level four. So we should be a little bit better than previously. So for the final time, we're going to see what this dude can do. And we're also going to do it while having a cabin fire. Now, interesting thing about having incidences you don't have to serve everybody. You have to serve a percentage of the people before the incident takes place. Now, when it comes to water landings, I've I've kind of played around with water landings before. We're actually on this gate here right now. Um, they will go around and sort people out with life vests and stuff like that. But I'm interested to kind of find out, do they actually put fires out? So I will allow and let my dude... Where is he? Is he at the back of the plane? No, he's not even at the back of the plane. Where is he? Has he not turned up for work today? Oh, there he is. Man, this dude this dude teleports. He shapeshifts. He does everything really weird right now. Right, are they coming through? Yes. Lots of passengers now on their way. So, will he put a fire out? Enough. I've just noticed that this plane, the majority of the people are sitting at the front of the plane. So... He's doing all the work again. He is literally doing all the work again. But this time, we're only going to serve a percentage of the people because, you know, fire is going to be happening. So, majority of people are sitting at the front. We'll, uh, you know, what? I'm going to let him do all the work. I want to see if he can do enough work to get to the percentage point that it triggers the fire. I want to know if he is now having the ability to get to that area. And whether I can just sit back, relax, and just let him do the majority of the work right now. That would be fairly, fairly interesting. So, if I stand over here. He served one. And he's just finished this one. Oh, no, he's finished this one. Two. He's on his third passenger right now. So, that person is now wanting the drinks. He does work super slow. I, like, I can't get over how slow he actually works right now. But a damn fool needs to be speedy. He needs to be so damn speedy right now. So, I don't think he will get to the point where he triggers the incident. I think he'll be like one or two customers off, I reckon. That's what I'm thinking. So, we'll just let him do what he's got to do. Enjoying ginger ales. Um, Going to be serving this lady next with a poor print on her face. Would you like anything to eat? She wants the egg sandwich. Could you imagine getting on a plane where everyone's eating egg sandwiches? Oh, that plane going to be so damn stinky by the end of it. It really is. It really is. Um, right, keep going. Keep moving. You got this. Appreciate it. On to the next customer. So he's done a couple. I'm going to um, put some blue lights on. Because you know why? I don't know. But now it's grey lights. Can I customise these? Uh, have the... 
Cast, um... Oh, no, 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 by music. Main lighting. Mood lights. I don't know what I've done. I've done something, and I don't even know what I've done. But anyway, how far has he now gone? I have a drink. Uh, hot chocolate. Take it. Enjoy. Um, he's done pretty well. At what point does he give up? Will he, I think he will give up after serving this passenger here. Hang on. One, two, three, four. <laughs> he didn't even get to serve that passenger right now. That's hilarious. That dude has no chill. Anything to drink, sir? A hot chocolate. So I've now got to take over the rest. Because now I need to trigger the event that takes place. Was it water she wanted? Yes. And I want to see if that dude now puts the fire out. That's what I'm interested in. That's all I care about right now. Anything to drink? Hot chocolate? There we go. Anything to drink? A water? There we go. Oh. Fire. 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 Will he put the fire out? Oh, everyone's burning. Everyone's dying. Uh, excuse me. Fire. There is passengers dying right now. I don't think he's going to do it. No. He ain't going to do it, is he? He is. I mean, the plane is 100% on fire. And he is not. Oh, my goodness me. He don't care. Can I make the plane continue to burn up to the point where it starts destroying my AI, dude? Will he then die and have to hire him again? Oh, I don't know. Right, I'm going to have to run through this because I can't bear witness to this. I can't bear witness to all my passengers right now dying. Oh, my goodness me. This is getting too much. Yo, could do with some backup right now with the fire extinguishers. So they help you when it's a water landing. But they don't want to help you when it's a fight. Oh my goodness me. I've lost a lot of passengers. You can already see that I've lost quite a few passengers right now. My safety rating is going to go down. <laughs> it really is. It really is right now. My safety rating is going to go down. Right, there we go. JJ. Fire's done. No help to the damn fool sitting in front. Get out of here. Oh, okay. Yeah, we've lost like 20 passengers, but it's okay. I'll go pick up the trash. Make sure you can pick up all the ashes of all those dead peeps too. Oh my goodness, this is shocking. Well, oh, you got you got no trash? You almost died though. Look at your health bar. Oh my goodness me. You guys got any trash? Any uh, anything you want to throw away that you could have just put on the fire and let it burn? There we go. Right, repairing the cabin. It's only a couple of folios here that need sorting out. Dude sitting here would have had his tray table out. <laughs> Seat belts. Sit upright. There we go. He sorts all them out. We're preparing to land. It's going to be a good one. Land this puppy with half the passengers that we took off with. I mean, where do they go? Where do they go when they get burnt? This is what I want to know. This is the things that I need to know right now. But nobody tells us. Nobody Loki. I'm open it. Where, where are they hiding in the toilet? I don't know, guys. I just don't know anymore. But uh, we've made it to somewhere. Back to New York City. Back to New York City, boys. And uh, we are... Wait, I can't even zoom in. We're waiting to open up the door. I can't believe this folio let people die. Shocking. Absolutely shocking right now. Open up the door. Everyone's getting off. Right, these cabins, no one's going to open because, you know... They all did it, did it, did it, did it, did it. Right, they're all open. Open, open. Done, mate. Are we done? Oh, no, this one here. Now we're done. Flight safety, zero. I wonder why. So we've learned that they can't... He's gone already. He's not waiting around for anyone. They can do the majority of the work. Do they want to do the majority of the work? No. Will they put anybody's misery and fire out? No. So, they're just here for the paycheck. They just want to get paid and go home. They don't care about if people get the right orders of food or drink on the plane. They don't care about if anyone's burning. They won't use the fire extinguisher. They are so damn foolish. And on that note, guys, we'll end it here. I hope you did enjoy it. Smash that like button down below. Until next time, I see you all soon. So, goodbye.